course, flu season is here, and it turns out man's best friend can also become infected. Cases of dog flu are being reported across Ohio. Two News reporter Dana Smith is getting answers on what pet owners need to know about the disease. Vets say dog flu is extremely contagious, and pet owners I spoke to say they're already taking steps to protect their pooch. Coughing, sneezing, and a fever are some of the symptoms your furry friend might have if she gets infected with the dog flu. I think I should get my dogs vaccinated. They do go for walks where they're sniffing where other dogs have been. Michelle Baker has two miniature poodles who love to go on long walks, but Baker said their next trip will be to the vet. I didn't know they got the flu, but they get other things, so yeah, why not? <laughs> Local vet Dr. Daniel Brower says he hasn't seen any cases come through his office in recent months, but with the highly contagious virus spreading across the state, he's encouraging dog owners to get their pets vaccinated. If they come in contact with it, they will get it. Dog flu can be spread through the air from dog to dog. Pet shelters in places like Columbus have had to temporarily close after dogs there got sick. And Brower said the virus continues to spread. There's been some cases in Mason, Ohio, now down in Cincinnati and Upper Kentucky. And then there's some outbreaks in Cleveland as well. And pets who visit places like, you know, the dog park or maybe the groomers or maybe you will board your animals sometime. Vets say those types of animals are going to be at a higher risk of catching dog flu. For more information, make sure you contact your vet. Reporting live, Dana Smith, 5 on 2.